shows the assembly of a kit cool room measuring 2.4 metres wide by 2.4 metres deep and 2.4 metres high. However, rooms can be supplied in any size you require. Also, the displayed kit room includes a panel floor with the floor panels mitered at 45 degrees to join with the wall panels. Depending on the application, the construction style can be modified to allow a drop-in floor to be fitted after the walls and ceiling are in place, or supplied without floor panels at all, if the cool room is located on a concrete slab on the ground floor. Note that freezers, being a cool room that operates below zero degrees Celsius, always require an insulated floor. The kit includes all walls, floor and roof, door, rivets and sealers. Mark angle lengths longer for exterior, shorter for interior, at intervals of approximately 300mm for drilling and riveting. The snip ends of connecting halves of floor for easy assembly. And apply mastic sealant along length of floor to be assembled. Drill and rivet at both ends of floor to hold in place. Cut external angle lengths to size and trim the ends to 45 degrees for fitting. Apply mastic sealer to lengths and check that floor is square. Now it's time to flip over the floor. Measure the height of the wall and cut exterior angle to length for the corner. Apply mastic sealant and fit length to corner edge. The corner edge of the wall is cut at 45 degrees. Fit corner pieces together and check that they are level. Chalk under side with cardboard or the like if required to achieve this. Next, apply mastic sealant to the exterior edging angle and fit to wall piece. Fit the next wall panel and repeat. Drill or rivet twice at top of the interconnecting wall pieces. Seal the other half of the roof with mastic sealant and place on top. Cut the door portions from the front panels. Next we need to seal the centre interconnecting edges of the front wall, use mastic sealant and fit to the floor and side walls. Check the levels. Next we need to fasten the upper and lower interconnecting front wall pieces. Next we need to fit the front portion of the roof into place. Measure the roof length and cut. Seal and fit the exterior roofing angle. The wider edge fits to the roof and the shorter edge to the wall.
measure all internal lengths and cut horizontal internal angle lengths to 45 degree angle at the ends. Remove the wooden bracing and all the nails from the door. Next we need to fit the door and clamp to the wall. Measure, cut, seal and fit the internal angles to the internal side of the door, ensuring the door is tightly home and no gap is apparent. Check all levels. Seal all the internal gaps at this point 